Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nana and today we're back with the Not So Very Challenge. Hi guys, today we are at Pepper's house and she's currently giving some financial consulting. She's always busy. Pleb is just keeping her company, busting some moves. I've been thinking she is supposed to be a stayed, a stayed, um, um, homeschooled she's supposed to be homeschooled she doesn't go out into the world to really talk and socialize with other people she doesn't really have many friends in fact she doesn't have any friends and it got me thinking what kind of person would she be just when i was trying to figure this all out i got a notification saying uh, school has been cancelled something like that i probably should read what it says but <laughs> i tend to like not really care much for um some notifications unfortunately also, she had a really weird want to learn couple counseling and now she wants to reunite a couple. I have to break it down to you, girl. I, I don't know who's not together anymore and I don't know whose relationship we could fix. Like, I, I honestly cannot think of a single sim right now that needs your counseling. And I don't think there's many sims that would take guidance from a 10 year old. But yeah, she is very... I would say she's very different than many of my sims and maybe because of the way that she's been raised i'm really not sure but like like appearance wise i think she's very feminine i think she's maybe more feminine than any of my other sims even rosie's always just had this feminine aura around her and i really like that i really I really do like it. She's not as clean as my other Sims, but you know, she is her own person. She's a combination of her mother and a father, and I don't think guys as clean as, you know, Rosie and Pepper are. So honestly, not too bothered by that. I love that she is very feminine and she's a little sloppy. Nothing wrong with that. But then she also has this tough, like this cool vibe around her, like this cool attitude because she's going to be going to space and she's going to wasn't she going to go into the army i think so she needs to be tough she needs to have some thick skin and i love that on the outside you're just like oh it's such a cute little feminine girly girl but then she's gonna turn into like this monster just watch watch and see uh, but yeah what else have we discovered about goldie she loves her grandmother as i thought they have such a good relationship she does have a wand to talk to guys so i might have her actually call him on the phone though that is a bit of a risky thing because sometimes a dad doesn't really end up working so maybe i'll for the sake of it just have him spawn should we do that let's just spawn the guy i changed his name and now i can't find the family oh my god dad came to visit so she's really excited to see um him here that he came over can we please turn the stereo key First of all, you stop worrying. Second of all, turn that thing off. It annoys me. Also, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but the last couple of episodes, I haven't really been able to plant anything. I think it's because I downloaded a, a mod. Uh, it's been messing with the gardening. It was a garden mod. I'm, I'm going to fix it soon, but I haven't really been home much lately. Now I'm just home. I just want to record a little bit, do some shopping, prepare. I'm actually getting some free guitar lessons. Oh my god, I don't know I'm talking like this. <laughs> Sound like a turkey. Um, as, as they're just talking, I'm just gonna tell you the story because, you know, they're just they're just talking, catching up. She wants to play with him, so maybe we'll just, just just swing me around. It's a little bit more intimate, but I think they're ready for that step. I think they're ready to take it to the next level. Yeah, you guys, I have a guitar. I got that for, like, my 14, 15th birthday for my grandparents. Really wanted it. Everyone had a guitar. Played with it once. Couldn't figure out how to how to work it. I mean, all you do is hold it and play. You know what I mean? Like you, you pull the strings. You make the, it didn't work. I I couldn't figure it out. And I remember my mom saying something like, "Oh my god, it's so much noise." Either way, it doesn't really matter. But yeah, I have one and I haven't played with it for so long. And uh, now I have a chance to like see if i like it so i'm very interested to see if i do like it i'm probably not very talented but we already established like i might be a creative person i like to say i'm creative i do like to draw do like to do youtube but i don't know if i'm musically like talented like that though the guy's mother said to me that she thought i was a creative person and she didn't even know me that well Oh my god, how did you know? I'm do do art, so... Anyway, god, that looks a little dangerous. Make sure you don't, like, smack her into the telescope. This is... I really... 
I know it's not part of the rules, but like I can't just have guy not show up. I think it's just I can't I can't not have it. I just can't. I think it's time for a hug though. Oh damn, that was a little too intense for our little girl. Why does she throw up like that? <laughs> She's like, I'm wearing a dress, so I'm gonna poke my bun here. And okay, 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 wait, 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 wait. Let's do that friendly hug before he goes. I don't want him to think about babies. It really concerns me. Pepper's just doing whatever the freaks he wants at this point. Also, some sad news about Pepper. She recently lost her best friend, Sharon Pons, ended up dying. And um, yeah, she got money from Sharon. I'm not sure why Sharon thought Pepper needed money, but I guess since they were best friends, it was the nicest gesture she could have done. I mean, she could have just put Pepper's name on the tombstone. I mean, that would have been cool, but no, she just kept her own name and gave Pepper some money. So I want to get her into like stargazing pretty soon. I did try and decorate her room, but I didn't really pay that much attention to. I'm pretty positive these last few episodes, or not the last few episodes, but these last few days here, or what am I trying to say here? There's, there's not going to be many more days here, so we're probably not going to play with this house for a while because I do intend to move her out as soon as, you know, stuff goes down. And when that does go down, we don't really need this room, so I didn't really put that much attention. Um, or I didn't put that much detail in the room. However, I do love this bed. This bed is a vibe. I've noticed she's taken, like, the biggest favor, the biggest liking to Honey. I think Honey is her favorite. She has decided this all on her own. She's just drawn to honey. She does like lemon, marigold, and the other one, lime, but honey is like her cat. So I do think when it gets to that point where I want to continue the generation, we're probably going to breed honey. Um, and these other three are just, they're, I, I don't think I want them. Maybe if the relationship goes up, I'll have them. You know, I'll um, have them like breed and multiply, but I think I just want to keep it to honey because just like, okay, why am I justifying this? These are, these are cats. I bet I'm, I'm, I want to justify my cat, <laughs> my cat. I want to justify the breeding options. Okay, okay then I, I accidentally stopped recording. But as I was saying, just because we have all those cats doesn't mean we have to reproduce all of them. I want her to keep, I want I want the family line to keep going. I think that'll be cute. So I'm definitely going to do that. I'm also bringing her downstairs so we can do some more jump rope. Oh, she's actually too tired to do this. Okay, anyway, we'll just teleport her back into bed and we'll have to say bye to Guy, even though... He's chilling. He's just chilling, but I, I do want him to, to go. Yeah, I, I like to keep the line going. I think it'll be cute to have like, you know, more um, like more than 10 gens of cats. I do think cats reproduce a little quicker, so we might actually end up with, um, you know, with more cats than sims, but that's all right. That's just how life works with cats. I like they, they don't live as long as we do. Unfortunately. I'm also gonna have Pepper stop because she's concerning me. She's been in there for like forever. I'm, I'm honestly kind of scared because like, you know, she could just go any second now. And I'm kind of ready and I'm really freaking hungry all of a sudden. Damn, okay. But yeah, as I was saying, I don't foresee them staying in this house for much longer. So the room is just a temporary room. There are a lot of things I like that I will take to her next house. Um, for example, I love this. So I'll bring this with us. This is actually more of a vibe than I thought it would be. So I'm going to take this with us. And I am definitely taking the bed and perhaps a rug and even this so there are there are, there are things and maybe the birth certificate i think it'll be kind of cool to take that with us mm. but she's so different she's such a different sim i want you to recharge yourself because it just it just really bothers me how every time pepper goes to bed he just stands next to the bed and just looks at her she um has different traits i would say she's very Obviously, she's very cat orientated. I mean, she doesn't have many friends. She only has her grandmother and the robot. So there's not really many options to socialize. Her dad does come over sometimes. I wish that her mother would come over sometimes, but she's just not ready yet. Though she has these mature traits that I, I guess I didn't expect to see right away. She loves reading. Now, reading isn't per se like a, an activity that only 
older people do. You know, kids love to read. That's a fact. But just how she wanted to read the couples counseling, that caught me off guard. I'm like, what kid wants to read about couples counseling? She's just very curious about learning. And I think she just has a big brain in there. And if she does love science and aliens and that kind of thing, it wouldn't honestly surprise me if, you know, that big brain of hers uh, did do um to do wonders one day so we're just gonna have pepper um you know, just just work out really she's not really you know doing much so as for like the rest of her hobbies she likes to read she does like to keep active i think it's just a very active sim and i think she likes sports so maybe that's just where that comes in um she loves the cats teaching them tricks um what else what else girl she um she does like to keep up with her appearance so she's very she isn't like she's clean in a sense of she loves to clean the house but she's a very neat sim a very clean sim so she loves to take care of herself make herself look nice put on nice clothes it's it's just she's just like rosy honestly she has this like i really like myself and i just want to like bring so much attention to my features and do my hair and paint my nails like she just has that naturally i think rosie did as well but a little less i think that just grew more because of like the things she went through but she's just naturally just such a girly girl and i think she and rosie could really get along i think they could so get along if you know they took the time to actually get to know each other she wants to bird watch pepper's days are really random lately she wants to work out then she will um, go downstairs, she wants to bird watch, maybe catch some bugs. That's really all she does. And then at the end of the day, she wants to impart some knowledge to Goldie. So she'll sit down with her. And I've noticed that for the most part, she teaches her mechanical skills. Not so much cooking. She doesn't really bother with the cooking. So I guess nobody's going to know how to cook in this household. Um, body skills, she just naturally has. Pepper isn't really teaching her charisma skills per se, but I think she's more so teaching um, teaching Goldie that there are ways to talk to people because I think she's also noticed that she's a bit harsh in her ways. Maybe she's not really around people enough to really know how to say certain things. And even with her dad, she might just be a bit impolite or a bit you know bold or rough i guess and yeah because of that uh, i think she's been giving her some like advice on like how to talk to people but honestly the best thing would be for her to go to school but you know pepper's still trying to like protect her i think i'm gonna put it like that like what if they're still trying to protect goldie by making sure she doesn't really go to school and nobody really knows where she is she's like being homeschooled so she's pretty much as secluded as one can be and then there's just a limited amount of people that can come into her life which definitely makes it hard to have friends but also to really develop yourself in certain ways and yeah the cats are like her life but i still don't really see her relationship i mean she just likes honey it's it's fine she just has all the time in the world anyway i feel like i want to do something different so why don't we just grill some hamburgers oh wait 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 actually um ha wait wait come back here uh, pepper come back in here i want to bird watch because that's what she wanted to do pepper is just she's just, just living her best life honestly living just her best life she also wants to catch some bugs so but i think we can do that what's this oh she wants to learn anger management okay sure Sure, we love self-improvement. Okay, let's do anger management. I do want them to have a moment together later today because they haven't really had that yet. Like, they've been together, but they haven't really been together. They haven't really had a cuddle sesh or a movie sesh or any sesh at this point. Damn, son, you hungry? Why, why have one? We can have seven. She's so freaking cute. Oh my god. She loves- I wonder if she naturally loves space as well. Because if she does, that'd be kind of fun. Oh, she loves sci-fi and aliens. Oh my god, she's like the perfect sim. She literally is perfect for the yellow gen. Oh my god. So I'm going to have her look through the telescope while Pepper works on her anger management. Honestly, it's never too late to 
is nurturing to learn. And I think it might even be so that Goldie sat down and read a book and she was like grandma you really have to read this book it's so good i i really like it and then pepper was like surprised that she was reading but also very proud that she was reading this book also i don't think pepper would have any child books i think she just has self improvement books and books about well mature content like mature um topics she's like oh my god goldie was right oh my god that's how you control your anger that's uh, just kind of funny but yeah, it's never too early to get her, um, you know, interested in science. And I think logic is definitely, like, one thing she would want to give, you know, give her. But she's going to have so many skill points before she's even a teenager. And that's just, it's just funny to me. I've never had a sim like that. I've never had a sim that was... I mean, I did give Rosie some skill points. I think she did learn a few of them, but I think Goldie is really probably the most developed kid that we're going to start a gen with. I'm, I'm really, I'm really, I'm really chuffed with that. Stop pooping, girl. Okay, let your grandmother give you some attention. We'll do play together. I okay. guess Pepper's going to live to see another day. Gosh, she is so close. So freaking close. I kind of want to speed through it because I want it to happen, but at the same time, I don't. I, it's, it's kind of hard, isn't it? It's really hard. Now, I want to impart some more knowledge. Um, She's going to need logic in her life, and I just want to give her, like, such a head start on this because between Pepper and Goldie... What am I trying to say here? They're, do you really have to sit here and read your... Write your... Do you... Okay. This robot is like a dog. You know, you turn around, dog there. I just wanted to say that I think logic is really something she has in common with Pepper. And it would be such a waste if she didn't get that knowledge from her. I guess it's, it's it, it happens as fast as um, it would be to play. But it feels just so much more meaningful having it come from Pepper. It just adds like a core memory or something like she'll always think of the time when she learned logic from her grandmother i'm gonna miss pepper so much when she's gone i swear oh my god i'm just but she's she's happy you know she might actually make it to the, the end of the bar i mean i've never had a sip like she's freaking ancient i swear rosie could get married and pepper could still be around like i'm telling you pepper could be a freaking 100 at this point she could definitely, I kind of want her to be at the, at the wedding now. Maybe we should just, maybe I shouldn't want her to like, you know, because like, for the story's sake, I should just have her there because it would be funny to have her there at her wedding, like be like two elders, like, oh, I didn't think we'd be here at this point. And it's like, Pepper's like, yeah, girl, I'm not going to go anywhere. I'm not going to go and do shit. Anyway, um, yeah. I think um, I'm gonna have her get back into bed and I think it's about time we head back over to Rosie and see if we can finish that gen. I would be so freaking happy to finish it. I'm not gonna lie, we have some few things to do. So let's head over there and I'll be, I'll see you guys right. Wait, hold on. <laughs> see you guys, see you guys right back. Okay, sure. Whatever I say, I'll be right back. See you guys there. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back here. Now, she works tomorrow at 9. We need one more logic skill. We're currently doing a crossword puzzle, but I kind of need Pepper's help. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to call Pepper. Um, also, pay her bills after that. I'm going to call Pepper, and I am going to ask Pepper to come over. Hopefully, the game lets me, because it's not always this friendly when it comes to this. Um... Please, game, allow me to invite over my mother. Um, just not do no. Let's just invite her over because I don't have I don't have um what do you call it I don't have a I have the thing you know use I don't have it. <laughs> also, why is my screen like this? All right, that's a lot better. But I don't have I don't have that thing, and I kind of need that thing. And we're so close to like aging up and becoming elders and oh my god, I just really want to finish it. I don't want her to work when she's an elder. I just, 
I mean, I do, but I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know what I want. I don't even know what I'm on about. But I do know that I need Pepper right now. I do need her. I, yes, there she is, our queen, our savior, Pepper, the Pepper. So we're gonna come over here, and we're going to impart the. Oh, I thought she died for some reason. Oh my god, I was about to get scared. I'm like, she died. Why can we only get? No. No, no, I wanted her to help me with logic and Pepper can't even help me with that. Pepper, you'd betray me. What the heck? I, you come over here, you come all the way here and you can't even help me? Okay, you know what? Just leave then. Wow, you're useless. Thanks, thanks for nothing. Or she kind of... Oh, fuck wrong sim okay let me make her unselectable and um we'll just go back to the computer then sure we don't need you anyway we're gonna continue writing a paper um let's see what he wants real quick oh he's still practicing so that's good he wants to reach the maximum in the dance and enthusiasm uh no the, no the the music and dance career okay that's what i'm trying to say he wants to win a dance contest he wants to be friends with sanjay and scold libby um, still wants to buy a vacation home. Maybe we'll do that when they're elders. Maybe. Um, Sir is gonna go to sleep. And I think I'll have to keep an eye on Rosie. Because I see her, it happening that she'll just end up doing something else. We're just gonna have to stay up all night. Because I want this promotion and I refuse. Okay. I refuse. I refuse. No 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 you go back you go back who knew you could make like eight hundred bucks isn't there wait 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 I think it's under a different like it's school study skills logic I think that's it we don't have to write an article we just have to that might be easier I'm not sure if that's easier or just looks faster but let's just get that done oh I can't forget she wants to master all of them Okay, cleaning will just, it will just happen by itself. Mechanical, uh, well, I guess Pepper could be useful now. Girl, don't you, we, we don't need to pee, okay? Peeing is for pussies, okay? Let's have her teleport downstairs. She's really just staying up all night to get this last skill point. I don't really, I don't care, girl. You gotta do what you gotta do. We're so close. I'll let you eat, okay, before going to work. If you if you keep it going, I'll let you eat. No, 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 don't you dare. We're so close. Oh, now she's too hungry to do it. Well, damn, Sam says. Quickly have her grab some cereal. She's gonna shove that stuff in her mouth. We're so close and she just wants to have like a, a snack break like no girl that's not how we do it no more distractions okay no more distractions we're so close <laughs> we're so i'm just holding my breath at this point okay all right we did it we've done it we've did diddly doon done it okay 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 she is gonna be super tired so we're gonna have a nap just take a nap girl Sleep it off, girl. And then I'm just gonna have him warm up again. I'm just gonna keep on having him. You know, do this. I also want him to play with this because it's been a while. She's feeling so good. She wants to wash the dog. <laughs> like, imagine waking up on a Wednesday and you're like, I really, oh, I really want to wash the dog today. Imagine. Okay, I'm going to. I'm gonna max all. I'm gonna cheat. She's gonna go to work. Also, I need to delete the helicopter. We don't have enough space. And when the Sims are trying to get back from using the helicopter, then um, things go like a little bit horribly wrong because I can't get the Sims back. So unfortunately, the helicopter didn't last very long. But this car, this car staying. So we're gonna drive off to work and I bet, I hope, but I, I bet and I hope and I hope and I bet that she's gonna get that promotion. Let's just get one more skill point for Sir here. And yeah, we're so close. Or maybe we're not close. Why does it look so close? Pepper's here. What's Pepper doing? Pepper, I'm sorry. I didn't... I don't care today. Okay, I just... No, I don't. Are we... Are we like max career or what? Why are we not able to get that last skill point? Did I say max career? Max skill point, I guess. Okay, I... 
Okay, okay, there it is. Okay, let's go downstairs. Let's work on some music. It's been a while since I've had him make some music. It's kind of nice. Maybe he wants to do something else with music. How about we have him come upstairs and how about we just practice the guitar? We haven't done that in a while. Man and guitar hot. Can't believe I got myself a man with a guitar. <laughs> Damn, okay, I love it. Um, and then maybe we'll have him sing as well. Just do a bit of everything. Oh, I don't think we can use it. Wait, his daughter is calling him? Man, that's huge. That's that's an absolute gigantic accomplishment. Oh my god. I honestly can't believe I, I can't believe it. I can't believe his daughter called him. I'm so happy for him. Also, I think our cat just aged up. Aw, look at him. Look at her, actually. That's so cute. Oh, she is so cute. Such a cutie. Such a cutie. Okay, Pepper? No, Pepper's not here. Rosie should be home in about five hours. And I don't want this episode to take any longer. And I'm just really, 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 really wishing that we can get this promotion. So I'll have him warm up and just do that the entire time. And we're going to wait for Rosie to come back. And then hopefully she comes back with that promotion hanging on her butt because I need it. I want it. I'm ready. All right. We have like half an hour left. So... Let's see what it's gonna be. Are we gonna get a promotion? Oh, you better, you better. Like, everything is perfect. If we don't get a promotion, it's just, it's, it's cracked. It's, yes, yes, yes. Rosie, yes. Oh, we've done it. Oh, I sh Bim, you can go home. I, I can celebrate this by myself. He has been promoted to mayor. As mayor of SimCity, you're entitled to big bucks. You can finally afford the house on the hill where the town's elite citizens cluster. You are a master at the political game. It's obvious you enjoyed the fame as well and the excitement of shaking up the entrance to bureaucrats. Bureaucrats. Why well, I said that really weird, didn't I? It's great to be powerful, isn't it? Rosie brought home like 4K almost. She works like four hours a day. Actually, she, she works six hours a day. I don't know why I said four. But yeah, we got to the top of her career. Okay, is this what she wears? I, hope, I wonder, do we have like a better like workout? I kind of want to, I kind of want to see. Um, dress for work. Do we get a different outfit? Because I don't really like this one. I mean, it's the color is nice, but do I get a new one? Oh, oh, damn. Oh, she's the mayor. Okay. I mean... I always knew you had it in your girl. Oh, gosh, she looks amazing. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy we've done it. Now wash Otis. Okay, she's been wanting to do this all day long. So you've earned yourself that. I am so freaking happy for her. We've done it. We could retire if we wanted to. I don't think we do. Why is Pepper still here? Pepper just... Why is she not here, I guess? Why is she not here? I think we're definitely up for a promotion as well when we go to work. So I don't think we have anything to worry. Maybe we just need to practice some more charisma and body. But we're just, we're definitely going to do that. We're definitely going to get there. Just going to have him practice and keep on practicing. But yeah, guys, we finished Rosie's part of the challenge. She, well, not her part. She hurt one. English, no comprendo, right? No hablo espanol, nothing works today. But uh, yeah, we made it. We finished one more thing for this challenge. So now all I gotta do is just finish on that cleaning skill, mechanical skill, cooking skill. But I'm not really in any rush to do that because it's optional for me. It's not part of the challenge. I can even do this after we technically finish the challenge because I have some plans and I think Rosie's still gonna be included in there. So Stay tuned for that. We have like five days, honestly. So everything is like panning out really well. All that is really left to do is to come here and to write that novel and to continue that novel. And then once we've done that, God, we're so close to finishing this challenge. So yeah, you guys, I'm going to be playing a little bit off screen. Get these uh, guys ready for more. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye.